Hello, boys and girls. Today's story is called Cake. It's about a cake that has been invited to his very first birthday party. He buys just the right outfit, including the perfect hat, which really lights up the room. One thing's for sure. This will be a party that Cake will never forget. I hope you enjoy the story. Cake by Sue Hendra and Paul Lynette. Cake had just received an exciting invitation. You are invited to a party. He'd never been to a party before, so he didn't know what to expect. But he was sure about one thing he wanted to look his best. Fish didn't know what cake should wear. He'd never been to a party either. Hmm, said Fish. Nope. I don't think so. What about a hat? suggested Fish. Good thinking, said Cake. So off Cake went to buy a hat. Cake tried on lots of hats in the shop, but none of them were quite right. Is it for a special occasion? asked the shop assistant. A wedding, perhaps? No, said Cake, a party. Oh, said the shop assistant. In that case, I have just the thing. And he disappeared out the back. Here you go, sir, said the shop assistant. You'll be irresistible in this. Thank you very much, said Cake. He couldn't wait to get home and show Fish his new hat. Are you ready? Cake called from his bathroom. Ta-da! You've done it! shouted Fish. Cake was soon on his way to the party, dressed in his new hat. Deedly dee, deedly dum, I'm off to a party to have some fun. Cake was a bit nervous when he arrived. But when everyone saw him, they cheered. Cake's here! A party isn't a party without cake, they said. And in he went. Cake was having so much fun at the party. There was dancing and lots of games. But then the singing started. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Cake was getting a bad feeling about this. Oh, crumbs. Suddenly, there was a gust of wind and everything went black. Then there was the smell of raspberries and Cake felt a wibbly wobbly hand grab hold of his and a wibbly wobbly voice said, Quick, run for it, Cake! Meanwhile, back at the front door, I do hope I haven't missed the party. The end. Thank you for joining me for story time today, boys and girls. What a funny story. I hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.